Rock and roll legend Eric Clapton admits he's going deaf. I'm John Bowden from rockhistorymusic.com. He turned 73 on March 30th, and at that age, sometimes there are things that a tune-up will not fix. He's been through a lot. Remember, there was drug and alcohol addiction that he tried to face in the 70s. In 1991, he lost his son after he fell 53 floors. He was only four years old. And then there's the loud music. We reported last year that he was suffering from nerve problems in his back and his hands, which made it difficult to play guitar. And now he's been diagnosed with tinnitus, which is the perception of a lot of background noise. At its worst, it will cause hearing loss, which is the case with Eric Clapton. He told the BBC he did consider quitting for a short time, adding, now I'm still going to work. I'm doing a few gigs. The only thing I'm concerned about now is being in my 70s and being able to be proficient. I mean, I'm going deaf. I've got tinnitus. My hands just about work. I mean, I'm hoping that people will come along and see me for more than because I'm a curiosity. I know that's part of it because it's amazing to myself that I am still here. So far, Clapton has only booked one show this year, the British Summer Time Festival at Hyde Park in July. Let's remember he's already left us more than most rock and roll legends. He was one of the best guitarists on the planet, involved in groundbreaking acts like the Yardbirds, Cream, Blind Faith, Derek and the Dominoes, and he had a fruitful career, of course, with a lot of collaborations. There's also a new documentary on Clapton called Life in 12 Bars, set to air on Showtime February 10th this year. Let's hope he can stay in music as long as he can. Rock and rollers don't quit when they're 65, and now that's a growing trend anyway with lack of retirement for a lot of people who are not in rock and roll. It's kind of part of our, of our culture to continue working as long as you can. It's your vocation, it's your purpose, and I hope you can stick with it. Make sure you comment on our videos, subscribe to our channel, and share our videos. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Music